Here you go. Um, sweetheart, yeah. I'm off to the Edwards. Oh. You know, we have to discuss about that property I told you yeah, about. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Goodbye, darling. All right. Take care of yourself. Later. Yeah. <laughs> That's my wife. <sighs> Jack. Yeah. You said you wanted to tell me something when your wife left the house. Oh, yeah, what well time? I need a person who can execute. Execute? Execute what? Uh, is there a business? No, no. I need a person who can execute someone for me. I'm sorry. Execute someone? Yes. Who? My wife. What? See, it's you I want to do this. I know about your past experience. I know how you lived a rough life in the past. And I know you're from the street, so you, it won't be difficult for you. Come on, Jack. Those were back in the days. You know, things have changed now. And why do you want to kill your wife? See, you know my wife is giving me tough times. All the property her father left, she's not even giving me any access to them. See, if I ask my wife for money, she'll be asking me what do I need money for. My, my own wife wants me to be given account of her own money. I'm fed up. I'm fed up. Jack, this is not a reason for you to kill your wife. See, come on, man. Come on. See, if I kill her, I have a lot of advantage. I'm a nest of kin. And if I execute, I will have access to all her properties. Why don't you fight for a divorce? And you both spill the properties. Mm -hmm. Look, look, look. This is not a good reason for you to kill your wife. Listen, just help me and you get your share. Look, when it comes to murder, just, just count me out. No, now, Water, come on. What I know you to be lord of the streets now. Okay, um... Just give me some time. Sure, sure, I will. And and you know what that will do. All right, I I need to leave now. Let's eat. You have not eaten your food. There's something I need to get. So, okay, if know. if you insist, we'll talk to you later then. All right. Okay then. Take care, man. Walter, street lord. Hey, water. Hey, Jack. Yeah. Oh, I know you must have been overwhelmed with um, emotions and all. Okay, that's why I pulled this call through for me to know your decision. I need you to make a decision. What if I don't do it, Jack? See, water, please. I, I really need you to help me out. If you can't do it, just link me with someone that can do it. I really need to get rid of this woman. Wow. Do you really have your mind bent on this? Yes, Walter. See, this woman has made my life a living hell. Do you know I don't have a million dollars in my account? Not even half. What kind of a woman does that? See, I want to buy the latest Benz 2022, but don't have such money in my account. See water, let's 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 strike a deal. If you can pull this out for me, I promise I will give you thirty thousand dollars. The truth is, I don't see a good reason for you to do it. But thirty thousand dollars is a good reason. Really? Yes, thank God. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, water. Thank you. So let's talk about the plans. Okay, buddy, let's do this. Oh!
this shouldn't have happened to Genevieve. How can I live without my dearest wife? It's okay, Jack. I don't think you understand how important she is to me. She's always there whenever I'm down. <laughs> she's my everything. She's not just my wife, she's my mother. Who could have done this to her? Look, look Jack, Jack, Jack. You need to take things easy. Look, whatever happened has happened. Please, just be a man. And I would go on with the investigations. I am suspecting that business partner of her father. And by the time I am done with that man, he will regret his actions. Oh, God. Genevieve. Genevieve, my baby. Yes. Hello? Oh, all right. Thank you. Jack, I just got a call from the hospital. They said your wife's body has been moved to the morgue. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. So I won't see her again. You'll definitely see me again. Oh! Genevieve! How is this possible? I thought you were dead! Jack, so you could actually do this to me? I'm not dead. Thanks to your closest friend here, Walter. What? Jack, so you wanted me dead? After all I've done for you? If not for water, so you would have killed me. All right, I, I know everyone is quite confused, but I will share more light to the story. You see, uh, Mr. Jack here has been complaining of how his wife has not been willing to give him money, and how his wife has not been sharing her father's property with him. So he decided to take her down. At first, I tried to talk him out of it, but it seems he has already made up his mind. So I decided to play along. You know, I discovered if I turn him down, eventually he will reach out to someone else and the whole plan will be carried out. You see, Miss Genevieve here is a very nice person and she doesn't deserve to die that way. Although I reached out to my elder brother and he told me what to do. Instead of killing her, I made her unconscious. Then I took her to my place and explained everything to her. So we carried on as if nothing has happened because she really wanted to see the fake tears rolling down his face. But what I taught you are my friend. I'm sorry. I cannot be your partner in this. What? I know I used to be bad and rough, but I still regret my actions. Jack, I'm sorry. So you betrayed me because because of a woman. Just shut up. Baby, I don't want to hear it. Cop, take him out of here. No, baby, no. Please stand. No, baby, please. So, babe. Please. Jenny, I'm sorry. Please stand. Baby, please. Please. Baby, please. Oh. Baby, please. Move. Babe, I'm sorry. Babe, move. 